Good evening, Dr. Brian. Dennis, a fellow classmate. Dennis, I enjoyed watching your videos and you make a lot of great points. And most of these points I don't dis disagree with. The global justice movement sounds like a great idea. I would love to live in a world where I don't have to worry about food, water, or shelter. But it's just not feasible in the in the life and world that we live in today. Um, yes, capitalism isn't the best, but it has had some benefits to society. For example, um, according to the Foundation of Economic Education, the number of people worldwide living on less than two dollars per day is, le is less than half of what it used to be in 1990. The biggest gains in the fight against poverty have occurred in countries that have opened up their markets, such as China and India. And those are both the countries with some of the largest populations in the world. Now, I'm not going to sit here and lie and say capitalism is great because it does have its cons. Uh, with capitalism, some of these private firms can mon monopolize, um, which that comes very bad things where they exploit their employees, charge high, higher prices, um, and they do sometimes ignore social aspects uh, in order to maximize a profit. They might look the other way regarding pollution, they want to have problems harming living creatures, and so on and so forth. And the other problem I have with capitalism is that it's the people that inherit the wealth from their families that have worked hard to obtain that wealth. Those are the people that haven't learned the value of what was created for them. Now, uh, capitalism also has its pros. Um, EconomicHelp.org says that economic freedom helps political freedom. This means like if the government has its own means of production, it would give the government too much power. And at one point, does the government have too much power? Then you start getting a state such as Russia, where Russia's government controls every aspect of their life. Um, efficiency. Efficiency also plays a big role because when you have competition, uh, there's pressure to cut costs, that will avoid waste, and it seems to make people more innovative. There are no better alternatives. Uh, Winston Churchill mentioned that it's been said that democracy is a worse form of government except all others that have been tried. A similar statement could apply to capitalism. Overall, it's not the best system, but it's the best system that we have so far. Thank you.